Let's continue learning about the volumes of prisms. Remember that in general, the volume of a prism is equal to big B H, where big B again stands for the area of the base, multiplied by the height. This is a hexagonal prism. So the base, when it's a regular hexagon, is found with a formula one half apothem perimeter. That means that the volume formula for the shape is one half apothem perimeter height. Well, when I look at the picture, I need to figure out the different values that I would use. Because I told you that this whole side is 10, that tells me that this length down here at the bottom of my special right triangle is only 5. Well, he's my A. My 2A here then would be 10, and my A radical 3 would be 5 radical 3. And this piece right here is my opossum. So the opossum for this hexagon is 5 radical 3 meters. The perimeter is found by taking the length of a side, which again was 10, multiplying it by the number of sides, or 6, which is 60 meters. And the height of the prism was given as 18 meters. So let's plug in our information. The volume again is 1 half apothem perimeter height. So the volume is equal to 1 half multiplied by 5 radical 3 times 60 times 18. Now remember, I like simplest radical form. So leave the radical 3 alone. Ignore it. Put the 1 half, the 5, the 60, and the 18 into your calculator, or do the arithmetic by hand and you'll find out that the volume of this hexagonal prism is 2,700 radical 3 meters cubed because remember, volume is always labeled in units cubed.